Yeah, and what? Mm-hmm. We back on the Fem Rap Politics playlist, child. We've been on this playlist for the past week because y'all already know it's just so much going on in general in female rap these days. So we got to talk about it. Why am I here right now? I'm here because it's Grammy season and everybody, or not everybody, some people are crying over the fact that Ice Spice lost her Grammy for Best New Artist to Victoria Monet. And I want to talk about that because. Why does Ice Spice need a Grammy for Best New Artist? Like, are y'all really, are y'all really ready for Ice Spice to win a Grammy? Period. What would that mean for music? What would that mean for female rap? And what would that mean for hip hop? If you're someone who's like me, always on YouTube, always looking at what people are talking about in hip hop and music, what are the common headlines these days? Why hip hop is dying? Why hip hop is dead? Why female rappers? Da 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 da. Like literally all day on YouTube, twenty four seven. If I Spice were to win a Grammy for XYZ, it would be, yo, the bar is really in hell. This is why hip hop is really dead. Are we really rewarding this? In my personal opinion, it's like, I don't think we're really ready for that because what would that truly mean for music? Yeah, Ice Spice is cool. She can make a bop. I'm probably going to bop to it, but I do. But do I feel like she deserve a Grammy? She did have a really big year ever since ever since she blew up with Munch. But here is the real like dark cloud over Ice Spice's head. Ice Spice is always going to be allegations of longevity. Ice Spice is an artist that is cool in the moment. I think Sexy Red will have the same sort of like dilemma. You're cool in the moment, but are you going to be here in three years from now? Are you going to be here in five years from now? If you look at a list of all of the artists who won Best New Artist in the past recent years, they're people who you done forgot about. And I'm tired of giving awards to people who we're going to forget about. I want to give awards to people who are going to be here in the long run. And so I think that Ice could prove a bit more longevity before seriously get uh, deserving, being deserving of a Grammy. That's what I personally think. Um, let me see what else I had to say. Oh, yeah. And this is my real point right here. Look at this. Hold on. This is I had tweeted this. T, the, you not you advocating for a female rapper to win when Nikki ain't got one. Nobody deserves nothing unless she gets it first. F all y'all. And I stand on that because, of course, female rappers have won um, Grammys like Cardi, like Megan, outside of Nicki Minaj, as well as Doja Cat. But I do not agree with giving female rappers Grammys unless you're going to give Nicki Minaj a Grammy. And I'm not saying like, oh, I, I need Nicki to win. Like, we're, we don't care about that. Check out my last video about what really happened last night at the Grammys regarding Ice and Nicki. I'm not gunning for Nicki Minaj to win a Grammy, but I am saying Ice Spice don't deserve no Grammy unless Nicki Minaj get one. And we don't even want Ice to get one with Nicki. We weren't here for that either. So unless y'all going to give it to Nicki first, Ice don't need it. These girls do not deserve Grammys. You know why? Because it's disrespectful when you're um, when you're giving them Grammys, but they are calling her name in the award speech. They are saying, I was inspired by Nicki Minaj. So why are we giving them Grammys when you didn't even give the Grammy to the one that inspired them? If it wasn't for Nicki Minaj, they wouldn't be here right now. We all wouldn't be here right now. And so I'm going to need history to correct that mistake before we could really move forward, specifically in the aspect of female rap. But what do y'all think? I'm very, very interested this is no shade to anybody I spies. Well, it's shade to Cardi because she don't deserve nothing. Okay. It's shade to everybody. Nobody deserves nothing unless it's Nicki Minaj first. So I want to know what you guys think. Thank you guys so much for listening until the end. Make sure y'all check out the rest of the Fem Rap Politics playlist and I'll see you in the next video.